Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today in this video, we will make a 3D of this component. And this is a, basically a sheet metal component. We will draw in 3D. We will calculate the weight of this one. And we will calculate the state length of this piece. So in the end how this piece will, will look like, it will look like this. So let's start. The weighting is very, very, the weight calculation is very important in into the engineering. When you guys join any company and your manager will come to you and he will give you a, a drawing like this then he will you have to calculate the weight because the tendering team or the bidding team have to know what is the weight of this component and then they will bid according to weight of the components so let's start so we will on top view here the height is 6 60 and this side 120 and this is 35 plus uh, right this one 35 70 thickness is 6 mm and radius is 6 mm So we will offset 6 mm and then we will trim. So this is the bending component. So we have to know what is the state length of this piece. So we will offset three for we have to come on the center only because this is uh, six M thick. And we will move this one. We will make a single line click here, join. So now we have we have to know what is the state length of this piece. For this one, type list list. Select this one. The length is 230 mm here. So how the piece will look like? Uh, 230 and 70 mm bits. 230. So this is the piece state length what is required for the final component. For a bidding purpose or any machining allowance we are giving 3 mm allowance for sheet metal component. So we will offset 3 mm. So this is a piece you have to calculate the weight extend and this
so we will go into this view we will extrude this one and this is 6 mm height so this is a, a piece which you are going to procure from the market the weight then the co your costing team will be calculate the costing of your this product according to this weight how we can calculate the weight you have to type here mass property that object and here the volume is given here i will take a print screen for calculation purpose so this is volume is 107616 multiply specific gravity of the steel it's 0.785 and divided by 10 is to 5 so the weight of this piece is 8.0845 kg so this is the weight of this component then later on we will calculate the final component weight so let's take a record so now we will ex and we will work on this one now we will extrude this one and is 70 let's move it some away away from the component and now we will rotate this one go to home click here select this one ucs and select that face now we will rotate and we now we will change again you see us click this one this one and the top we will go to isometric viewer so this is a basic shape we already done now here now we will go to and top view this is 2020 we will also trend this one and it is 6 offset 6 and now we will draw a circle here and we will trim now
we will mirror this one now we will join this one this is our top view now we will extrude this one we will minus 10 and we will mirror this one so now we will subtract this one this one click here subtract select this one this is done now we will cut this radius here we'll offset 10 then offset 35 we will cut circle radius 35 we will trim this one line from this point to in this one trim this one also we will delete this one we will extrude this one minus 10 and we will mirror this one the other side again we will subtract this one from this so we will go to top view again so this and now we have to come on this side here we have to click on uses here here uh, select this one 